Tonight, Portsmouth police are investigating a possible case of vandalism at Puddle Dock Pond. It is forcing Labrie Family Skate at Strawberry Bank Museum to shut down and cancel the remainder of the skating season. Sarah Smith and her husband are two of several people who ventured out to Labrie Family Skate only to find it closed for the season. It's a little bit more winter fun, but today it's empty. The rink at Strawberry Bank Museum was closed because of an incident Portsmouth police are investigating as a possible act of vandalism. It's very disheartening to see this, I would imagine. Huh? It certainly is pretty sad. Strawberry Bank president and CEO Larry Yurden says right now it looks like the rink was tampered with overnight. He says it looks like someone opened this valve spilling glycol onto the ground. About $10,000 worth of glycol out on the lawn. We're working with the EPA. It was fortunately, it's biodegradable, so it's not damaging to the environment, but we'll clean that up. Typically, the glycol runs through hundreds of feet of plastic tubing under the rink, keeping the ice frozen. Now that it's been released, the glycol has left a muddy mess on the ground and a slushy surface on the rink, one that cannot be refrozen. Yurden says the search is on for the perpetrator. We do have a webcam and we're examining the footage, see what's, uh, what's on there. But that's cold comfort to residents like Smith, who feel like a vandal has sidelined their winter fun. Oh, it's very frustrating. And again, police are investigating the ice rink at Strawberry Bank, attracted more than 20,000 skaters this season alone.